cold again. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It is Friday, April 2nd, and feels like winter. Um, today I'm gonna be installing the floors on the camper. I'm headed to Lowe's, it's about 7.30 in the morning. I'm gonna go get some alcohol-based cleaner to prepare the floor. I'm also gonna get some sort of adhesive because I've heard mixed reviews about these peel and stick tiles online. Some people say that they work great. Other people say that you need some extra adhesive to get them to really stick, so um, I'm gonna take all precautions. Anyways, let's go get some gas and we'll head to Lowe's. I just noticed that this was broken too. That's gonna need to get replaced. That looks terrible. All right, off to Lowe's. still 31 degrees out it's a beautiful sunny day hopefully it warms up again it's only 8 30 in the morning so it will warm up a bit but i don't know apparently it's supposed to be pretty warm for you to be installing these tiles so i don't want to install it if it's anything below like 50 degrees well today's the day we've all been waiting for Finally gonna get the floors put into the camper. I'm pretty excited about this one to be honest. This is really, really overdue at this point. I'm gonna get started by applying a layer of this multi-purpose primer onto the floor. All right, so I finished applying the primer to the floor. It's not showing up super well in the video, but it's sort of a white, I don't know, Elmer's glue sort of consistency. And I just used a roller brush and rolled it all over the floor. And it should take about, I think it says a half hour to three hours to dry anywhere in that window. So it's about 60 degrees out, it's sunny. I'm gonna say it's probably gonna be dry in about an hour. All right, first update since I started laying the floor in. It's been about an hour, maybe an hour and a half at this point. I had to take a few breaks because I wasn't ventilating well enough. I actually opened up a couple of windows, but for a while there, I was feeling kind of lightheaded from all this construction adhesive that I've been using. Um, so far, it looks pretty good, especially from afar. When you look up close, you start to notice some of the imperfections around the edges here. Um, it's pretty minor stuff, though. It's not too bad. I'm just taking my time with it. It's probably the worst spot, but again, it's not that noticeable. All right, so here we are. Flooring is basically complete at this point. And it looks pretty good. There's a few spots I'm not happy with. Right over here is big one. I might cut a little piece in there. Same with over here. And basically just these corner cuts. I did well with some of them. But the camper is old and some of the wood is bowed so it was hard to get clean cuts like this one looks good for the most part the vinyl planks actually stuck down pretty well um, this area right here is the one exception 
as you can see I have this weighted down it's actually holding it down pretty well but this has kept popping up this popped up like two or three times now since I put it down so just trying to keep some weight on it until the adhesive dries so I bought some dark brown caulk for corners such as this one where the gap isn't too bad but as I said before, corners like this, I mean, this is definitely gonna need another little piece cut out. So I'm gonna get on that. I would like to get everything done tonight completely. And yeah, it looks like an entirely different camper in here. <laughs>